For nearly a century now, bacteria-fighting drugs known as antibiotics have helped control and also destroy many harmful bacteria that can make us sick. However, antibiotics have been losing their punch against some types of bacteria. Certain bacteria are now unbeatable with today's medicines. The way we have been using antibiotics is helping to create new drug-resistant superbugs. And now, artificial intelligence is helping discover these new drugs that can kill superbugs. Here's more on the path-breaking revolution. Take a look. Globally, alarm bells are ringing over superbugs. They are resistant to the drugs that should destroy them. They are difficult to control and treat. Most antibiotics and other medications have no effect on superbugs which are strains of bacteria, viruses, parasites and fungi. A few examples of superbugs include resistant bacteria that can cause pneumonia, urinary tract infections and skin infections. Drug resistance is a naturally occurring phenomenon that can be slowed but not stopped. Over time, germs adapt to drugs that are designed to kill them and change to ensure their survival. This makes previously standard treatments for some infections less effective and sometimes ineffective. But now there is hope on the horizon. Artificial intelligence has come to the rescue. Banking on AI, researchers have found a new type of antibiotic that works against a particularly problematic drug-resistant bacteria. The researchers focused on one of the most problematic species of bacteria. As per US CDC, the new bacteria can cause infections in the blood, urinary tract and lungs or in wounds in other parts of the body. It can also colonize or live in a patient without causing infections or symptoms, especially in respiratory secretions or open wounds. To find a new antibiotic, the researchers first had to train the AI. They took thousands of drugs where the chemical structure was known and tested them on this bacteria to see which could slow it down or kill it. This information was fed into the AI so it could learn the chemical features of drugs that could attack the menacing bacteria. After scientists trained the AI model, they used it to analyze over 6,000 compounds that it had previously not encountered. The analysis took an hour and a half and ended up producing several hundred compounds, 240 of which were then tested in a laboratory. The laboratory testing ultimately revealed nine potential antibiotics, including abosin. So how is artificial intelligence used in medicine? AI in medicine is the use of machine learning models to search medical data and uncover insights to help improve the health outcomes and patient experiences. AI algorithms and other applications powered by AI are being used to support medical professionals in clinical settings and in ongoing research.